Hey Tender Drummers! So I don't know what happened, but in early April, my channel got a huge boost in views. I don't know if someone posted something on Facebook or what happened, but wherever you are out there, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. It really has helped grow the channel in these last few weeks. A couple other videos that got a disproportionate amount of views were my 2002 Cavaliers videos. And I also got a couple requests for some 2003 stories. So in this video, I'm going to talk about the 2003 Cavalier Tenor Line. Now this line was a much more experienced line than in 2002. Our center, Ben Collins, he was back for his third year with the Cavaliers and his second year being section leader, so he was definitely very comfortable leading and managing the line. Mike Hodges and I were in our second year, and anyone out there that's March knows there's a big difference between your first and your second year with the core. The first year, you're just trying to hang on and not mess up. The second year, you have a lot more confidence, you're just a lot more comfortable with your surroundings, and it was definitely the case for me. Outside of Mike Hodges was Brad Mathern, and he was a 2001 Cavalier tenor vet who took the 2002 summer off, but he was back for 03 for his age out, and he was a very solid player. He actually went on to enlist in the Air Force after aging out. The one rookie in the tenor line was outside of me, Michikazu Narita, who's from Japan and a member of Aimachi, and he was just so good. Oh my gosh, I was absolutely spoiled having him outside of me. Everything he played just looked so effortless. Just, it was so smooth, and nothing about him was tense at all. And Jim Bailey, our tenor tech, was nice enough to let me keep my inside spot, because Michi was definitely a really, really good player. So I'm planning on doing another video more focused on the 2003 show and some of the licks we played in there, but the one piece of music that really showed what the tenor line was capable of was our on-field warm-up Flowis, written by Mike McIntosh. This is just a really cool piece of music. It, it has a little bit of everything. You have cool rhythms, you know, weird stickings, a bunch of flam rudiments. And one of the best parts was Mac let our center, Ben Collins, write the voicing. So he enlisted the help of a 1999 through 2001 tenor vet, Ted Morris. As you can imagine, when you let two young guys write the tenor around part, of course, it's gonna be completely overwritten to the point where we didn't even play it in the lot in 02 because it wasn't quite there. But in 2003, we were all over it. And other than like a little lull for a few days in the summer, we had this thing locked in and it was just so much fun to play. So the one recording I have of us playing it is on this 2003 lot DVD. Since this is no longer for sale other than for like $75 on eBay, uh, I am going to post a clip or two from this DVD. This is the only recording I can find, so I don't have any other choice. So because of that, I'm willing to offer 100 American dollars to anyone that can provide a recording of just the tenor line playing Flois. Whether in the lot or on the field, whatever, I don't care, but it has to be the 2003 tenor line. Please hit me up, leave a comment, whatever, get a hold of me, and I will gladly pay you for that. I'm going to go ahead and play the recording from here, and I'm also going to play along, and it'll cut in between me and the recording, just so you can see the entire tenor part. So I hope you enjoy this video, and again, I'll post another one or two videos focused more on the actual 2003 show, but for this one, let's go ahead and take a look at Flois. Thanks, Tanner Drummers. I'll see you on the next video. Flois, let's go. Bring it. 